Hello and welcome to Department in the Spotlight. I'm Captain Lloyd Mack. And I'm Command Master Tisdale. And I'm Zedin Carnahan from uh, DECA. I want to thank you guys for joining us today. Um, we're going to talk about some new things going on in the commissary. So I'll kick it off with a couple of questions. Ma'am, why is DECA introducing commissary brand products? Um, sir, uh, DECA is introducing store brand products to expand the set of quality options for DECA shoppers and to create savings for customers and taxpayers. And how will DECA ensure that the commissary brand products are of high quality? Um, DECA is modeling its store brand product to match well-known uh, uh, nation brand, and DECA has set the bar uh, high for quality selection. Very good. Will introducing commissary brand products uh, mean that patrons will no longer have an excellent selection of national brand value products? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, patrons will still be able to find a large variety of national brand they now purchase at the commissary. Mm, good. So when will commissary store brands be on commissary shelves? Well, uh, DECA will launch a commissary store brand product st starting in back in May. And the time frame here at uh, Tsugi is, it started this month and we already have them on the shelf. Great, great. What about the commissary brand? The commissary brands are consist of three items. The, uh, the food is Freedom Choice, and uh, Nan Food is um, home base, and also the um, medical, like HBA or stuff like that, it's called Top Care. Okay, well, great. Well, I want to thank you for coming on the show today and introducing us to this new brand, and I want to thank you all for joining us today, and uh, that is all for our Department of Spotlight.